So for a top of the line vision insurance company, how do we look at cost? What is cost? I'm representing a large company, let's say. How do I determine what that cost should be so that I can determine which vision insurance company to go to? Well, hopefully they're weighing the, the allowances, the frequency of services. I assume a company's gonna get several prices. Um, it's harder to analyze it. Premium dollars is easy to analyze. You know, this is a single rate, family rate. Yes. But then you gotta actually look at the plan. And what it does. Right. I do see people that seem to just focus on cost. They're not necessarily looking at the, what the employees are gonna end up paying out of pocket at the point of service. Well, and, and isn't there, I mean, it seems to me there's also the other side of it, that if the vision insurance company is really good and handles, I'm the head of HR now, and handles all the problems and takes it all off my shoulders, that that's a savings to me, that I don't have to worry about. So there's a difference between what that sticker price is and what the real cost is. So that if right. we've got great customer service, Right? They ought to save me, the head of HR, a lot of time, wouldn't you think? Sure. They should save you a lot of time, a lot of headaches. But yeah, absolutely. I mean, all the small things I think would go into a product. We want to make sure that they can work with us, me, the person in HR, and all the people in my company. Right. So we want to make sure that when we look at cost, and we don't just look at that by itself, that we look at all those other intangibles like terrific customer service, what is it like when my employee calls through, what is it when I, as head of HR, all those things. I would certainly hope. I would <laughs> certainly hope. All right. Good answer.